Hey, welcome back to the channel. Um, so, we're trying out um, something that's not OHR related. We're going to do a new game just came out today called uh, Virtua Verse, and it's a point and click adventure. I'm unlikely going to play most of this on camera. Um, I'm definitely going to play at least the first 20 30 minutes uh, just, you know, to see how it goes. Um, but I don't, I've just I discovered this yesterday. I had an uh, email through GOG come in and explored it and thought, hey, that game looks pretty cool, and I just I knew it was immediately the, like my type of game. So that's what we're playing. It's version 1.00. Um, I don't know how many bugs are in this thing, um, but uh, we're going to give it a try. And uh, I'm not going to look at any of the websites right now because I want to play the game. Uh, hopefully it'll work. I don't know what the level of maturity is on this, so... Um, I don't care about the preferences. We're just going to play the game. So, anyway. Just watch and enjoy. I'm probably not going to do a lot of commentary. I just want to play the game. I really want to enjoy it. Um, in fact, I'm tempted to take my headphones off. But, uh... Woke up and Jay was nowhere to be found. My glasses were laying on the floor shattered. Darn! Yeah, sorry. I don't know what's going on. I gotta get my headset fixed as soon as possible. There's a place downtown that should be prepared to them. Be able to, okay. Um. Okay, I'm so if you're not familiar with point and click, this is a um, classic of uh, the 90s, but this particular game is brand new. Uh, but this is a game I, or not this game, this is a style I used to love uh, early on. Um, so you, typically the icons, you know, they, um, they affect how something looks. It's one of the greatest point and clicks of all time, in my opinion. It's The Longest Journey. If you haven't played that, it's uh, fantastic. It came out about 20 years ago. Um, but yeah, the premise of these types of games is to just explore and try to move the story along. Um, this particular story, Virtual Verse, he, he wakes up, she's missing, he's trying to figure out what happened to her. It takes place in the cyberpunk universe. Um, so, that's really all you need to know. Just watch the game. You're going to learn it as, as I do. I wonder what it actually is. Alright, let's see what we got in the inventory here. Um, we are looting. I hope I didn't crash the game already. Hello? Oh, okay, good. Alright, so this is my headset. Um... Don't stay on for any more than half a second. So my understanding is he's able to um, one well, shatter. He's able to see um, the real world. In this particular world he lives in, there's a um, everybody's plugged into these. It's kind of like the Matrix almost, where they're plugged into the um, oh, we'll go back in. They're plugged into this virtual world, um, and he has the ability to see the real world. So, that's what I know of. It's a box of noodles. My dinner from 10 days ago. So, he's just living like a real college student, I guess. I don't want to take any of these anymore. 
but you're going to, right? Um, so we'll uh, we'll take them. Through the synthesizer, let's look at the cheap model from the 50s. I'm assuming it's the 2050s. It tastes like a sewer rot. Ugh. Just like the 2020s. We'll uh, use it. No? Alright. Do we uh, get anything new? No? Okay. Alright, we'll pick up the noodles. Just in case we need it. Master Boot Wrecker. This is uh, the name of the group that's made the uh, music for this game. Final records inside of floppy disk chips. Pretty clever. So, met during that tour. She still sings sometimes. It's my favorite kind of woman. Preferably not one that's got a, you know, ad sign on her head, but I like singers. Singers are nice. That's my move. Whoops. Um, work at Strange Gizmo. He used to be my best friend. This is Siri. Hi, Gizmo. Hi, Herman. Any messages for me? One new incoming message. Message from A and D Electronics. Subject payment reminder. We hope you are enjoying the board we sent you last month. This is a reminder that your first payment is now overdue. Please disregard this message if you have already made your payment. How are you today? I am incapable of feelings. What's the weather forecast? Uh, look at the window. It says cyberpunk. Today, rain. Cyberpunk city. Of course it's raining. Forecast is always dark. Oh, hello. Where's Jay? Maybe part of loving is learning to let go. So true. Especially the letting go part. That part's inevitable. You think you're pretty smart, don't you? Hey, that's almost uh, Jimmy Knightley's uh, singing. This is pretty slick. I'm equipped with a, basically a terabyte. And I only need a nanosecond to access it all. Is there anything useful you can do? With no power comes no responsibility. <laughs> Give me your diagnostics report. I am fully operational and all of my circuits are functioning perfectly. You are a useless piece of junk. What we think we become, oh God, that's harsh. Need to go, stand by. Acknowledged. So this is a staple of any adventure games. You have to have the, uh, the uh, comedy. Oh, hoverboard, neat. It's an SK hoverboard, or S S-gate. Uh, this model is a toy equipped with 20 years of battery life. Oops, hold on, did I skip something here? No, nope, okay. Pick up hoverboard. Wow, he fit that in his jacket, good. Pretty impressive. Fallen here is the computer evolution. DY hacking, three volumes. The art of firewall exploitation. Advanced network forensics. Inside the cyber warfare. History of cryptography. Grandma's top 10 cooking recipes for computer junkies. Pick up books. I read them all already. I didn't read them yet. Oh, so the gizmo is the robot. Okay, I thought for some reason I was looking at the head. All right, cool. All right, bed. Look at bed. Looks messy. Can you make it up? 
I can't sleep, the headache is killing me. Uh, just like my regular Tuesday. Look at the drawer. It's not a medic drawer, I'm just kidding. It's actually Thursday, so feel that way. Okay. Um, so if you don't play adventure games, really the whole element is you gotta just look at everything you can. Sometimes it picks a lot. So if you go into the bag, you can see what you picked up. Um, so AVR headset, still can't probably use them. Yeah, we'll see them for half a second. Um, meds, use meds on noodles. Yeah, I guess not. All right. Um, then typically you want to just try to combine everything you can. So you can put the noodles on the hoverboard. Just wondering what's going on in your mind right now to try this. I mean, noodles on a hoverboard, it's just like a serving plate. It's uh, noodles that don't touch the ground. Best kind of noodles. All right, what we can probably do is maybe we can put the... The other thing is you want to sometimes try to take the noodles outside and then try to use them on something. So use noodles in the food synthesizer. Already cooked, partially eaten, and totally rotten. Okay, and then if that doesn't work, we can try the meds on the synthesizer. Nice idea for suicide party cake. <laughs> oh gosh, maybe not for today though. All right, let's go back outside real quick. <coughs> let's look at the keypad. What, my code isn't working? How is it possible? All right, um, so we'll try the noodles on the code. Did you get that idea? <laughs> yeah, now. All right, so clearly we're not using the balcony right now. So we'll probably have to do that later. All right, so we're going to go outside and explore out there, and then we'll uh, probably call the episode. Um, I'll probably do a next part just to see if this is enjoyable for everyone. Oh. Okay. So, let's see, waste bin. Let's look at the waste bin. Mark solid the waste bin. Um, broom. It's been a while since I've reused it. Toilet, smelly. Get lipstick writing. I have to leave, can't explain. Oh, well, that explains it. How to crack the door and change your code? What? Hmm. You should still have that reset password written down somewhere. Probably in the wastebasket. That would be my guess, Jay. New entry has been updated in the journal. Press J to open it. Um, anything else here? Sink. All right. All right. I'm sure the uh, notes in the waste basket there. It's the waste bin. Is it? You take out the trash. trash yet. All right, let's go over here. Let's look at the arcade. A video game. Modern arcade game from the last century. That's so depressing. This coin return. There's plenty of coins. Take them all. Good. Did it already. Sign Golden Burger Award. Or for eating 24 burgers in a single day. Wow. Full from that, a big plastic palm tree can be into acid rain. Yep, it's immune to growing too, I guess. Machine belongs to Jay. I love this game as much as I love her. Um, so, how much do you love the game? Panel stuck. Okay. She can't play it, alright. Hardware, much club power. Wow, okay, look at workbench. Lots of things happened here. Alright. Okay. 
Hacked Ultra Glove about years ago. Coated with movement sensors for the hand and fingers. Excellent for AVR. Or for being the life of the party. So I guess uh, this is pre... Um, uh, what's that uh, thing that Power PlayStation has? Totally don't know what I'm talking about. One thing about this game I'm um, not a fan of at this point is if I go too far off of these, either of these, like I lose the access and I have to do it again. So it's kind of annoying. Duff covered uh, straight out of my old floor. Wow. Uh, game changer in the early days of computing. Okay. And then tools. My wrench and screwdriver. Okay. All right, well, I'm sure we're going to want those. Just taking the screwdriver. Not the wrench. Okay. Hardware. Pick up the hardware. Pick up. Better leave this here. Cheers, keep losing one of the components. Pick up the Ultra Glove. He was improving the drawer or driver some days ago. Let's see if it's still working. Uh oh. Yeah, it's working nicely. Okay, good. All right, I guess that's everything here, except for the hardware. Can't pick up. Uh, all right, we'll uh, come back to that. Um, let's see if there's anything else we need to see. All right, let's go look at the broom. Let's go pick up the broom. Let's see if we can clean things up here. It's pretty handy. How does that fit in your jacket? <laughs> wow. I go in. Oh, I can't take a bath? Alright, let's see um, if I can get uh, anything in here. We'll, um, let's see if we can put the noodles in the shower. shower. Mm. Use it in the toilet. It's nonsense. Throw them away. Could fix the smell in the bedroom. <laughs> okay. All right. Use. Um. All right. I don't know if that was a good idea or not. The screw is the screw. Can I use it on the coin return? Play safe card inside. Oh, good. Joy Bisset, ID number one billion. She forgot to take it with her when she left. Okay. So I guess we'll take it. Ah. What did it say? I've been using this for hack. I to play games in the arcade cabinets at home. But usually this card is used to access the online services. Change the limited amount of your personal data. Okay. All right. Can I uh, put the jumper in the AVR? There's no jumpable parts. Okay. Throw the. Screwdriver on the waste bin? I'll trash it. Uh, anything else I can do?
Alright, what did this say again? Alright, let's go back to the elevator. I guess I didn't need the noodles. It only, I guess it only takes me up and down, okay. All right. Um, anything else. Yeah, it's empty. Alright, I guess that's all we can do. Oh, I should turn off the sink. Don't want to waste water. Alright, let's see if we can use the um, lift now. I guess I haven't figured this out yet. Okay, hold on. Um, Hold on, maybe I need to go use the broom on the trash. <laughs> so how do I... I take out the trash. Hmm. Okay, well I can't go into the shower. Hmm. See, this is the fun part about point and clicks is when you get to a point where you don't really know what else to do. You feel like you've done everything, but you know you haven't because otherwise, you know, you'd be further along. Um, maybe I want to put the jumper back on the hardware. Is that? Should I? Is that what I want to do? Want to do that? Um, what's it for? Just the jumper. If you right click, you can see what it's for. Should I put the screwdriver with the jumper? No. Yeah, it'd be nice if this defaulted to reopen when you put it together. That's one thing I don't like about adventure games in general is the thing cl Okay. This really needs a docking mechanism. This is a really cool game so far, but there's some uh, UI stuff that I think uh, would be nice to have them, uh, you know, like this window not going away just by, you know, I think I should have to be able to click off instead of just veering off. Um, unless can I, no, is there any other, oh well, whatever. Um, so I can't use the screwdriver on the EVR. Uh, screwdriver on the glove? Ah, there's no need to open, it's working nicely, I don't know. Hmm. I 
can't put the, these together. All right, so I think I tried all the logical combinations. Let's do. Don't want the screwdriver on the beds. Can I do? All right, you know what? Let's try to take one of the panels off. Um, oh, wonder. Can I use the screwdriver on the the lift? I wonder. Oh, hold on. I have a better idea. I am going to do that. We're going to... No, hold on. Let's keep out of my bed. Ah. The plot thickens. It's that time of year again. It's not my drawer. He wants to bet the uh, passwords in here. Okay, so let's use the broom to stop it. Should we fit? No, okay. Screwdriver. Oh no, maybe the hoverboard will do it. Hoverboard drawer. Not work? No. Okay. Screwdriver a button. Should I just turn it off? Use that. Um, so the screwdriver doesn't work on the drawer? Maybe I can slip it in. Oh, well that's what I was going to do in the first place. I got too clever with the big items. Okay. I did the trick. All right. Let's see. Ooh, jacket. Pick up. Let's see. Look at jacket. It's my good old jacket. Pick up the jacket. I left my credit card in the jacket. I generally avoid tracked payments, but this might come in handy. Okay. I don't think we're done yet. Don't want anything else from this old jacket. Well, don't you want the password to your lift? Talk to the robot. No, nothing. Okay. Let's can use this on the balcony keyboard. Dark Can I use um, jumper on this? We're trying to figure out where did you write it down, dude? Hmm. Oh, let's look at the books again. All right, they got it. Oh, wait. Hold on. Yeah, they have to be in his books, right? Let's go look at the books again.
sure there's nothing else in the jacket. All right, let's get the screwdriver back out. I wonder if there's any place I just haven't gone yet. All right, anybody have any ideas? Where have I not? Oh, maybe there, derp. Okay. So this is a classic trope. I've seen this done, I think, in um, either Longest Journey or The Moment of Silence. One of them had the torn corner. This is where the password is. It has to be. So we look. It's come unglued. So probably want to... Oh, well, actually, maybe take the broom on the flip corner. There's a code right on the corner of the past. Yep, there it is. Okay. And we'll look at the code. The code is 15287. All right. We have the code. And we will uh, reveal the code in the next video. Thanks for watching. Uh, just kidding. We're not going to end the video here. Um, not yet. I do want to say that um, this game is $15 at Steam and GOG and I guess wherever other games are sold. If you like it, um, check it out in the description below. And um, support the developer. It's, uh, I think it's the developer's first game. So far, so good. But... Um, I actually wasn't kidding. We're going to continue on in the next episode. I just needed to make sure I you know, get the plug out because you know I don't want to have a video and not plug it. Because um, I think it's worth it. But we'll, uh, we'll do at least one more episode. Come back tomorrow for uh, part two. And we'll, uh, we'll see where this uh, key card goes. But um, yeah, I hope, uh, hope you enjoyed it. And I'll uh, see you then. Bye.